What you're about to see is part one of a two-part series having to do with the prefix CONTRA, C-O-N-T-R-A. This first one is going to deal with the word control. And the next one, part two, which you're not going to want to miss, has to do with the word contract. So thank you for joining me. And without further ado, here we go. I'm going to preface this video by stating that I am with the position of peace and neutrality with the performance of the balance of the honor and the grace and the maintenance of the rule one rule equal. It's the reason I'm doing this video and what I'm going to, the performances that I'm going to share with you during the video. What I'm going to do is first look at this word control from Webster's 1828 online dictionary. And I've chosen some of these definitions here. It says exercise restraint, direct influence, dominate. Now, those are all things that are contrary to my position of peace and neutrality. I don't want to restrain anyone. I don't want to influence anyone because influence is modification. And we know what modification is. Modification is what, are what uh, adverbs and adjectives do. And I certainly don't want to dominate anyone. Because I'm with the position of peace and neutrality. As you see here, they also give the LL spelling of control. So, when we parse the word, you can take it syllable by syllable, the parts of the word, and we have con, which means together, and I've done a video on that, I'll leave a link to that right there, and then the other part of the word is troll. Now, I'll leave that up to you as to what you think troll means. I'll leave some screenshots on there to give you an idea of some of the different definitions that are out there. But when you take the word and look at the actual etymology of it and its nativity roots of what it means, it comes from contra, which means against, which means no, Latin contra. And then the next part of the word of control is rotulus, which is also from Latin, which means document, rotary, wheel, turning. So control is no contract because this is a particle of negation means no and then document to contract or it can mean no turning, no contract. So this word I'm going to take out of my own personal construct and instead there are other words that we could use for this like there are other things that I use in, in my biosphere such as stewardship guidance and lead which in this next part I'm going to give you a finite meaning for lead which for the most part is the word I will use instead of this one so here is the word lead, which I would use in place of the no contract word 
control in my construct because lead is in compliance with my position of peace and neutrality and I will explain why as well as give you an overview of how to construct a correct sentence structure. For the lead of this finite mean is with the claim of the factor, with the governance and with the navigation of a vessel, with the terms of the joinder documentation and contract with the certification by the vessel authority. The backwards, for the vessel authority of the certification is with the joinder documentation and contract of the terms with a vessel of the governance and of the navigation with the factor of the claim with this finite mean by the lead. So going forward, we have our cause, which is lead. And what is, what is lead concerned with? This finite mean. Now we put our verb of the thinking in because we have our two points with which to draw our straight, correct line. We put our thinking in. Now we can continue on with the rest of the claim. Possessive. What is the claim concerned with? The factor. Possessed of what? The governance and navigation. And what are the governance and navigation concerned with? A vessel possessive with the terms. What are the terms concerned with? The joinder documentation and contract possessive of the certification with the authority of the vessel. Backwards, the cause would be vessel authority, and the vessel authority is concerned with the certification. Then we can drop our verb of the thinking in. Because we're going along that straight line, we've already put our two facts in, and we go into the possessive of the claim, which would be with the joinder documentation of the, and contract, and what's that concerned with? The terms. And then we have the possessive, the vessel, and what is the vessel concerned with? Governance and navigation. Possessive of the factor, concerned with the claim, Possessed of the finite mean, possessed by the lead, which is the authority, because this is the finite mean of this work. This works for any situation, especially with oneself, or perhaps with children, or perhaps with a group of people who have consented to someone else to lead them. Not to control them, or dominate them, or modify them, but to lead them. Thank you for joining me. As mentioned earlier in the video, I'm going to be coming out with part two, and I'm going to be discussing how the prefix contra figures into the very important word, contract. If you have any questions about this video, the grammar contained in the video or about correct sentence structure communication parse syntax grammar i.e. quantum grammar in general feel free to reach out to me at my email address jasonmatthewg17 at gmail.com have a great day